before taking our class today take a relief for one minute and take your position close your eyes inhale and exhale before inhale after exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale now students open your eyes and put your hands everyone welcome to shivaji group of institutions today this is your first period it is of english firstly i am going to take your oral first of all take out your left hand like this and right hand like this and hold it together and say with me today i am going to recite a poem five little monkeys now let's start five little monkey jumping on the bed one fell down and bumped his head mama called the doctor the doctor said no more monkey jumping on the bed four little monkey jumping on the bed one fell down and bumped his head mama called the doctor the doctor said No more monkey jumping on the bed. Three little monkey jumping on the bed. One fell down and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor. The doctor said, "No more monkey jumping on the bed." Two little monkey jumping on the bed. One fell down. and bumped his head mama called the doctor the doctor said no more monkey jumping on the bed one li one little monkey jumping on the bed one fell down and bumped his head mama called the doctor the doctor said no more monkey jumping on the bed Now students you have to learn this rhymes at home with the help of your parents So students this is time to do written So take out your English notebook and open the page where it is written use of a or and Okay now we will do articles today how to print articles As you know students that the english alphabet consists of 26 letters in all of these the vowels are a t e, i o r q the vowels are a e i o r u okay the rest of them are known as consonants I repeat again, students. As you know, that the English alphabet consists of twenty-six letters. In all of these, uh, the vowels are a, e, i, o, and u. The rest of them are called consonants. Use of a. Let's read with me. Okay, this is a. Chair. So we will use a uh, before chair. This is a chair, and this is mango. And we will use a before mango because it is singular. A mango. A book. A kite. A ball. These all are singular numbers. A book, a kite, a ball. A book, a kite, a ball. These all are name of things and stand stand for singular. 
and starts with consonant sound. So we will always use a before consonant. Let's read a apple. A apple. An elephant. An ice cream. An orange. An umbrella. These all are name of things. I'm going to repeat it again. An apple. An elephant. An ice cream. An orange. And an umbrella. These all are the name of things. And they are also singular. These all are begin with vowel sounds. We use and before all of them. Let us see. And apple. And elephant. And ice cream. And orange. And umbrella. Now students. Or take out, take your pencil and look at the blackboard and write with me. Okay? I hope you all understood the A F N. Now we'll start the today's work. Okay? What is this? Which picture is this? This is the picture of a car. So C is a consonant. C is a consonant. So what we have to fill here? A. This is a dollar. 
you all you all play with doll okay girls you are like to play with doll na this is dolls so doll b is a consonant so what we will write here we will write here Now this is your second period. It is of Hindi. Firstly, I am going to taking your oral. First of all, take out your left hand like this and right hand like this and hold it together and say with me. Today, I am going to recite a poem. Upar chanda gol gol. Now let's start. Upar chanda gol gol. Niche dharti gol gol. Mummy ki roti gol, papa ke paise gol, bhaiya ke laddu gol, hum bhi gol, tum bhi gol, sari dunya gol matol. Once again, repeat with me. Upar chanda gol gol, niche dharti gol gol, mummy ki roti gol, papa ke paise gol. भैया के लड्डू गोल हम भी गोल तुम भी गोल सारी दुनिया गोल मटोल नाउ स्टूडेंट्स यू हैव टू लर्न दिस टाइम एट योर होम विद द हेल्प ऑफ योर पेरेंट्स नाउ स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स स्टार्ट रिटर्न वर्क फॉर दैट यू हैव टू ओपन योर हिंदी नोटबुक स्टूडेंट्स ओपन योर हिंदी नोटबुक एंड ओपन द पेज वेयर इट इज रिटन देखकर लिखिए बच्चों आप लोग वो पेज खोलेंगे जिसमें लिखा है देखकर लिखिए बच्चों हम लोगों ने कल पढ़ा था वर्णों को जोड़कर लिखिए क्या पढ़ा था कल वर्णों को जोड़कर लिखिए आपको हम बताते हैं जैसे हम लोगों ने कल लिखा था का जोड़ ला का और ला को जोड़कर क्या शब्द बनता है बच्चों काला कर काला कर उसी क्रम में बच्चों आज हम लोग शब्द देखकर लिखेंगे शब्द देखकर लिखेंगे हमारा पहला शब्द क्या है फाला फल फाला फल यहाँ पे हम लोग फा ला फल फा ला फल सो स्टूडेंट्स आपको क्या करना है आपको देख के सी वैजिटिस कॉपी करना है एंड यू ऑल हैव टू टच द लाइन सब लोग खुद को लाइन कर 
टच करके लिखेंगे एयर में कोई भी नहीं लिखेगा यू ऑल हैव टू टच द लाइन्स हम लोग फल खाते हैं ना फल हमारी सेहत के लिए अच्छे होते हैं फ्रूट्स ऑफ ग्रुप ऑफ हेल्थ ना एंड इज सीजन ऑफ मैंगो तो आप लोग मैंगो खाते हैं ना ओके और नेक्स्ट वर्ड है हमारा हाला हल हाला हल ओके हाला हल हल से का क्या यूज होता है हल किसान लोग यूज करते हैं ना खेती करने में फॉर्मर्स यूज टू यूज हल ना ओके आला हल नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज नाला नल नाला नल से विद मी एंड राइट मेरे साथ बोलिए और लिखिए नाला नल आप सब लोग लाइन टच करके लिखेंगे ओके नाला नल ओके नाला नल के बाद क्या लिखा है काला कल काला कल कल मीन्स टुमोर कल मीन्स टुमोर ओके राइट काला कल Do your work in neat and clean handwriting. Okay? After कल क्या लिखे कल के बाद बच्चों क्या लिखे हैं गाजा गज गज किसको कहते हैं हाथी को हाथी को गज भी कहते हैं ओके हम लोग यहाँ पे क्या लिखेंगे गाजा गज गाजा गज गाजर गज के बाद क्या लिखे हैं पाला पल तो बच्चों आप लोग भी यहां पे पा और ला पल लिखेंगे पाला पल खाता खत अगले क्या लिखा बच्चो साबा सब साबा सब ओके हम लोग यहां पर क्या लिखेंगे साबा साबा सा ओके साबा सा के बाद क्या लिखा है जाला जल जल आप सब लोग जानते हैं ना किसको कहते हैं बेटा यू ऑल हो ना जा ला जल जाला जल किसको कहते हैं पानी को कहते हैं जल ही जीवन है आप लोग तो सुना होगा ना जल ही जीवन है क्योंकि जल के बिना हम लोग एक पल भी नहीं रह सकते जल हमारे लिए बहुत जरूरी है ओके आप लोग 
बोलेंगे कि जाला जल आफ्टर जेल क्या लिखा है यहां पे बाला बल बाला बल बल का मतलब बच्चों आप लोगों को पता है क्या होता है बाला बल का मतलब होता है ताकत इम्यूनिटी इफ यू विल ईट योर फूड प्रॉपरली यू विल टेक योर डाइट आप अगर वेजिटेबल्स खाते हो फ्रूट्स खाते हो टेक सीरियल्स एंड पर्ल्स यू विल गेट हेल्दी यू विल बिकम बल शाम दिस इज बाला बल ओके एंड आफ्टर बल नारायण नारायण नर इज रिटन ओवर हियर ना रा नर ना रा नर नारा नर students let's start our maths work this is your maths period for that you have to open your maths notebook take out your maths notebook and open the page where it is written circle the smaller number okay all of you have opened the page okay now look at the blackboard i am going to explain okay see here this is one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay. Look at the blackboard. See, this is one, and this is one and one, two, and this is one, two, three, and this is one, two, three, four. This is one, two, three, four, five. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And here it is nine. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and this is ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now see. This is one. This is one, and this is two. So two is bigger than one. Two is bigger than one. So one is smaller than huh? so we we'll, we will circle the smaller one. We have to circle one. 
which we have to circle one like this here i am writing four four okay and this is one two three four five six seven eight eight is bigger than four okay i am writing here eight so which one is smaller four is smaller na so we have to circle four okay like this we will write here ten ten is here and after it i will write it fifteen here so tell me which one is smaller obviously ten so we will circle the number ten okay i hope you all are understand to this okay so i got students this is Three and this is number nine. Which number? See on the blackboard, students. This is number three and this is number nine. Which number is smaller? Three numbers is smaller now. So what you have to do? Take your pencil and circle the number three because we have to circle the smaller number. Three is smaller than nine and it is. And the next number is seven and three. Again, seven and three. Again, three is smaller. So we will circle three again here. Okay. After that, number four is written here, and number one five fifteen is written here. So which number is smaller? Number four. So we have to circle number four. Okay. This is one two twelve, and this is one nine ninety. So which number is smaller? Twelve is smaller, na. So we have to circle twelve number. All of you circle with me, okay? This is number one eight eighty, and this is number seven. This is number. Seven. Which number is smaller? Seven. Seven is smaller, na. So we have to circle number seven. Okay. And this is one five fifteen, and this is one six sixteen. So which is smaller? Fifteen. So we will circle the number fifteen. Okay. And here, look at the blackboard again. This is nine. And this is number one, two, twelve. Which number is smaller? Number nine. So we have to circle number nine. Okay. After that, we move to number seven to seventy-two. And this is six one sixty-one. Which number is smaller? Six one sixty-one. Because sixty-one comes before seventy-two. Sixty-one. Seventy-two से पहले आता है ना फोर आता है तो दिस इज़ स्मॉलर सो सो वी विल सर्कल इट ओके दिस इज़ टू एट ट्वेंटी एट थ्री एट थर्टी एट सो ट्वेंटी एट इज़ स्मॉलर सो यू आर आर टू सर्कल ट्वेंटी एट ओके आफ्टर डेट दिस इज़ फोर थ्री फोर्टी थ्री एंड फाइव थ्री फिफ्टी थ्री व्हिच वन इज़ स्मॉल Circle number forty-three. Okay, this is four nine forty-nine and five zero fifty. So which number is smaller? Four nine forty-nine, na? Because fifty always come after forty-nine. So we will circle forty-nine. Okay. Now look at the blackboard again. This is two nine. Which one is smaller? Number nine. So we will circle nine number. Okay. And last number is six five sixty five and four nine forty nine. So which one is smaller? Forty nine. So you all have to circle forty nine. Okay. I hope you all have understood the. 
smaller one. So go through it. Okay. And two. And two your crossword. Okay. Like this in this copy. And after completing your crossword, you have to complete your homework also. Do homework same as it is crossword which I have taught you in the class do your work in neat and clean manner okay so students this is your previous period this is your fourth period for that what you have to do you have to take out your previous notebooks first and take out the page where it is written parts of body okay we have already learned few parts of body before. They are eyes, nose, ears, head, okay, and legs. Okay, now today we will do few more ones. Okay, see at the blackboard. Which picture is this? This is the picture of legs. This is the picture of legs. Okay. And this is the picture of teeth. You all are having teeth now. Show me. Okay. This is the picture of teeth. And this is, what is this? This is neck. This is neck. Neck means garden. Okay. And next picture is of, guess, guess, guess. What is this picture? This is the picture of a finger. This is the picture of a finger. Okay. And this, this is leg. This is leg. We walk with a leg. Okay. Now students, take out your pencil and hold it and write with me. See how I am writing it. Write L-I-P as L-I-P lip. L-I-P lip. L-I-P lip. Say with me. L-I-P lip. After lip. Next picture is of teeth. Next picture of teeth. So we will write here teeth. T double E T H T double E T H T double E T H We chew our food with teeth. Okay? Next is neck. This is a picture of a neck. So we will write here neck. Okay? N E C K Neck. Say with me and write. N E C K Neck. N E C K Neck. We rotate our head with the help of neck like this. Okay? Now next picture is of finger. Next picture is of finger. See? F I N G E R Finger F I N G E R Finger F I N G E R Finger We hold things with the help of finger na? Okay The next picture is of leg Next picture of leg we walk with the legs now. Okay, so we write your leg. L E G leg. L E G leg. Okay. Now I hope you all understood this. Okay. So repeat it with me. Okay. L I P leg. T double E T H T. We chew our food with the help of T. Okay. T double E. T H T. This is neck. N E C K neck. N 
ई सी के ने वी रोटेट आ है विद द हेल्प ऑफ ने एन ई सी के ने दिस इज द पिक्चर ऑफ फिंगर ओके वी होल्ड द थिंग्स विद द हेल्प ऑफ फिंगर्स ना सो एफ आई एन जी ई आर एफ आई एन जी ई आर फिंगर एंड दिस इज द पिक्चर ऑफ लेग एल ई जी लेग एल ई जी लेग वी वॉक विद अ लेग्स ओके आई होप यू ऑल अंडरस्टूड वॉट यू हैव टू डू नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू लर्न ऑल दिस स्पेलिंग्स बाय हार्ट विद द हेल्प ऑफ योर पेरेंट्स आफ्टर लर्निंग द स्पेलिंग्स यू हैव टू राइट इट इन द कॉपी फर्स्ट ऑफ यू complete your class work first of all you have to complete your class work like this okay after completing your class work you have to do your homework in neat and clean handwriting and if you can paste the picture of the picture paste the picture of the body parts or make the picture of body parts okay complete your work in neat and clean handwriting and do all the work today which you have done in neat and clean handwriting okay bye bye now students today's class is over till then bye